In April 1990, Dr. Robert and Kay Zufall opened the doors of the Dover Free Clinic and began a long-standing commitment to provide high-quality health care to the city's most needy and underserved. This is a story of how goodwill and volunteerism spread throughout a community. This is the story of the Zufall Health Center. The story began in the 1980s when Bob and Kay Zufall took a trip to Iga, Peru under the auspices of the CARE program to aid in the development of a urology clinic at the local university. Rather than just travel and look at the castles or whatever, we'd like to get involved. So we thought, what better way than getting involved uh, medically? They gave to us and we took from them the same kind of thing. Internationalism, I mean, this is another world, but many things are the same. We realized that there were a fair number of low-income people in uh, Dover, New Jersey, the very town that uh, I had been practicing in. And so we thought, well, maybe we can uh, do something there. And so they did. With a couple of grants from the United Way and the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation, Dr. and Mrs. Zufall set up a clinic at the Morris County Organization for Hispanic Affairs one night a week. But the Zufalls knew it wasn't enough. And I heard that maybe we could get a grant that would help us uh, maybe get a better location or more equipment or whatever. Well, the commissioner wanted to see this clinic. So he came, a little bit nervous, and he trotted in and looked around and he said, I want this one. And uh, the commissioner of health arranged them to give the grant, give us a small grant. With his new grant, the Zoo Falls moved the clinic to St. John's Episcopal Church on Blackwell Street in Dover and soon began to attract other volunteer doctors who were willing to donate their time. We put a little ad in the bulletin of the County Medical Society and said that we, like the Marines, were looking for a few good men. One of the reasons I came was my wife told me when we were married, uh, through sickness and health, but never for lunch. With the volunteer support staff and doctors, the Zoo Falls were able to open the clinic twice a week and expand services. In 1995, Dr. Bob and Kay Zoo Fall moved the clinic once again to its current location at 17 South Warren Street. As a result of a small city grant and with the help of the town of Dover, we were able to uh, buy the current facility it was very much my pleasure to aid in that transaction. However, in 2003, due to cuts in the New Jersey state budget, the Dover Community Clinic faced serious financial problems and began to look for other sources of funding. In December of 2004, with the support of the Department of Health, the Dover Clinic was awarded federally qualified health center status, making it eligible for state and federal funds. Well, there clearly is a great need for, uh, for these services in this community. And as I was just saying about expanding the hours and the services, I mean, they, they, as soon as we did that, people came. You know. Well, I, I think it's rightly needed to handle the predominantly uh, Latino population that we serve. It's rightly important for the hospitals. We save the hospitals from millions and millions of dollars spent in emergency care, which is not reimbursed. They lucky to have this clinic uh, on this uh, county. Um, I think they really see the value of the clinic. It, it operates to offer something that the federal government feels needs to be done, that is get the care to the people who need it. And it works in rural areas, and it works in urban areas. And it certainly is working here in the Dover area. Now with FQHC status, the newly renamed Zufall Health Center still remains true to its mission and pays tribute to the countless individuals who made their dream into a reality. We are very grateful to have Eva on board because she has a, a, a lot of experience with, as you know, with the FQHC, and uh, uh, 
We think she's going to be a tremendous help to us. Yeah, she's a very wise and caring person, as you already know. And uh, that's nine-tenths of the job. I'm very happy and excited to have been appointed the new President and Chief Executive Officer of Zoo Fall Health Center. Now that we're a federally qualified health center, the staff, the board, and I have the opportunity to develop this very small health center into a, a center that can truly meet the needs of the Dover community. We're really committed to providing the highest quality health care services. And these would include things like prevention, care for chronic illnesses, prenatal care, and also enabling services like outreach and health education. As the health center grows, we join our colleagues in the community health center movement across the country to work towards health care access for all, regardless of ethnic background, income, or insurance. I invite all of you to work with us in this effort. Together we can truly realize our Founders' vision. Thank you.